guys, it's AJ for Life, and today I'm going to be doing a decorating my dollhouse video for Easter. So before I start this video, I just want to apologize for being missing for a while. Over February break, I went on vacation, so I wasn't able to film because I was away. And then pretty much every weekend I have volleyball tournaments, so I can't film on weekends that much. And on weekdays, I go to sleep super late at night because I'm working on homework and I have school activities just after school. But anyways, I'm going to be filming this Easter video for you guys. And by the way, um, I have a Deck Up the Dollhouse video coming soon. And I also have a DIY video that's like related to it. So without further ado, let's get right into the video. So here's the box where I store all of my Easter decor and I'm quickly just unboxing it and showing you guys all of my stuff. So I have Easter grass, Easter baskets, treats, candy, and I made all of the treats and candy I'm showing you guys in here. And I have a video that I made last year called DIY Easter Party and I showed you guys a bunch of Easter DIYs in that video and I also showed outfit ideas and just like Easter um, inspiration so definitely check that out and here I'm just showing you guys all my baskets I made an Easter dyeing kit as well I have peeps uh, candy and I have tons of Easter eggs and the Easter eggs I either bought from the craft store or I made and I use all of this stuff to decorate my dollhouse with I'm going to be decorating the bottom floor of my dollhouse. So we have the living room over here, and then we have the dining room and the kitchen. And then on the left, I have an empty room, which I usually make into like a holiday themed room, but I'm going to be making that into a backyard, but usually now I just like make it into a holiday themed room. So I don't think I'm gonna do anything with that room because I don't have that much Easter stuff to fill up a whole entire room. I'm just gonna start off with the living room and for the living room, I'm going to add like spring themed items and like make it bright and colorful. And then for the dining room, I'm gonna add all of my Easter stuff on the table, like my baskets and all my Easter eggs. And then the kitchen, I'm probably gonna do a mix of like Easter and spring. Let's get started with the living room. The living room is done and I feel like it looks super cute and it's really colorful and as you can see I added a bunch of like colorful items I added like a lot of flowers and floral stuff so quickly I'm just gonna say where some of the stuff is from before I go on to the dining room so on the couch I have this little bunny and this is from CVS this is just a piece of fabric I'm using as the throw blanket and the pillow I made in a spring room decor video a long time ago. In the corner I have a watering can and it's from our generation and I just put some fake flowers inside. Next to the TV I have this plant from our generation. I have this wooden arrow that was already there on the fireplace. This picture frame I made in my spring room decor video. I'll link it in the corner of the screen so you guys can watch it. And then I have this piece of scrapbook paper to be kind of like a table runner. On the coffee table, I have a remote. I have another piece of scrapbook paper. And I have a tray I also made in my spring decor video. And lemonade and another drink from American Girl. And then over here on this chair, I have this pink flower pillow that is from American Girl. So that's it for the living room. So this is my doll's dining room and I don't know exactly what I'm going to be putting on the table. I think I'm just gonna fill it with all my Easter decor. <laughs> Thank you. 
So this is how the dining room looks and I think it looks really cute and very festive for Easter. Um, I don't know if the table looks like a little crowded or not. I'm not really sure but I'm just going to leave it like this because I think it looks cute and I didn't really know where else to put the baskets. Also I just added some random food on the plates. I put some like bread and then donuts and cookies because I had no clue what else to put. So yeah I just put that stuff there and that is it for the dining room and now I'm just going to move on to the kitchen. This is the kitchen and I'm just gonna remove the joy sign in the corner because that's still from Christmas. So I'm gonna take that out and I'm gonna replace it with my Hello Spring sign that I made in my spring room decor video a while back. Now I'm going to be pretty much only decorating the island I think because I want to make it kind of into an egg decorating area. So since I have a lot of extra Easter eggs left over and I also have this egg dyeing kit that I made, I'm going to be making this into an egg decorating station. So that is it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and also please subscribe to my channel if you guys want to see more videos. Also make sure you turn on my post notifications to be notified whenever I post a new video. Love you guys so so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!